Yo, what is good, YouTube, and welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're going to be doing gameplay with the new Primetime Ruby, Landry Fields. This card looks like one of the best rubies in the game. I'm very excited to use him, see how good he is looking. Uh, before we hop into this, if you haven't, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Help me push towards the 2500 subscriber mark on the channel. No, I haven't uploaded the last two days, and I apologize for that. I do have COVID, um, and it's really kicking my butt right now, which is no fun. Um, but gonna try to get this video and one more video out for y'all today on these new cards and uh, try to rebound as quickly as possible but uh, i appreciate y'all bearing with me right now because i definitely feel like crap and uh, it's really kicking my butt not fun at all but we're gonna get this landry fields gameplay out to y'all and one more and uh, try to keep it pushing hopefully recover soon be able to get back to the normal content um and yeah, without further ado, let's hop right into it and see what Landry Fields is looking like. So Landry is an 84 offense and 91 defense. He's six foot seven uh, with a 78 driving layup, 76 midi, an 85 three and an 80, 80 driving dunk. So offensive stats aren't crazy, but they're definitely solid enough. He can finish at the rim. He's got an 85 three point shot and he can dunk the ball a little bit. 79 ball handle as well. So with a coach or shoe, he could probably be boosted up to that 85 for a speed boost. 88 steel, 88 perimeter, perimeter is really, really good as for, especially for a six, seven shooting guard. Like he's got really nice size, the shooting guard position as well. 80 speed, 76 speed with ball, 80 excel and an 80 lateral quickness so what i will say about this card is he's not going to be the best creator in the world but as a three and d guy at the um at the um shooting guard position for especially for ruby he's going to be incredible this might be one of the best ruby cards in the game uh 10 gold badge which are captain shoot corner specialist glue hands pick dodger clamps interceptor off ball pest bailout ankle braces and grace under pressure as well as 14 silver badges which are fearless finisher teardropper pickpocket pogo stick tireless defender slithery finisher needle threader set shooter hot sun hunter bullet passer special delivery fast twitch menace and hustler so overall a lot of defensive badges some shooting badges as well looks like a super solid 3 and d card let's hop in a freestyle and see what he's playing like in that mode all right, so Landry Fields. Um, honestly, his jumper's pretty good. It looks similar to, it looks like kind of like Devin. I mean, it reminds me of Devin Booker's release. I know it's the same base as Devin Booker. I don't know what the upper is. I haven't greened with it yet, but I feel like I should be able to get it down pretty consistently. There's a green. It's pretty quick, um, not super hard to green. It's not bad. I think, honestly, this is the type of jumper that might be better on next gen than on current gen as well. Uh, we'll test that out in a second. But um, dribble sigs wise, he uh, doesn't have a great dribble style. He's got pro one behind the back, which is pretty good. Um, an 80 driving dunk as well, so he can throw it down in transition. Um, but he's not a type of card you're going to be creating with. He doesn't have quick first step. Uh, and I think while he can technically get quick first step and he can get some other badges and stuff, he's mostly just a 3 and D cone defensive guy. I don't even think I showed the badges that this card can get. But um, honestly... Just a, when it's a when it comes to a ruby card, you're probably not going to want to add a lot of badges to a ruby card, just because they're not the type of cards that will likely be in your lineup long term. But for a ruby, this Landry Fields card is looking really good for sure. Um, looks like one of the best ruby cards in the game, and his jumper is super nice. So let's hop into some triple threat and see what Landry Fields can do. All right, so hop into some triple threat. Um, honestly, I don't think this Landry Fields card. I'm going to take my no. I'm going to kick it to the corner. Landry Fields for three. I shoot a white. I think that might have been a full bar, but we knock it down. It's a good shot. Um. Again, this is not a card who's going to be a primary ball handler, but he's going to be a guy who can play some defense and play some offense. And I'm not even sure if this guy is playing that I'm playing against, but um, I do think Landry Fields is just going to be able to play a defense at a very solid level um, and then play some offense as well. Does have gold clamps, which is super nice for a shooting guard. And I know he can get some more badges as well. He gets like a lot of good badges. I didn't even look at those, um, but definitely going to be a solid card. Not going up against a great team here either. Um, going to try to, well, you know what? He's being guarded by an ember. Let's see if he can create a little bit. Why not? Um, going to the rim, Landry Fields. Okay, I like it. Nice little dunk right there. That's good stuff. Getting to the rim, beautiful. This guy's team is very bad. He's got well, he's got free stuff, free agent John Wall, who's amazing. But besides that, he's got two pretty awful cards in uh, Del Curry and Luke Longley on his feet on his court. Um, good cut off. Yep, get out. Good D. That's uh, he's kind of a late closeout, but we will take it. Good, good contest. D out, D Rose. Come on, yes sir. Get in front of him. Good. Very nice. Watch the back door. Good stuff. Yeah. What? How's that not a steal? He shot it very late or very early. Wow, that's embarrassing. But that should have been a steal. Landry Fields, catch and shoot, knock it down. Misses. Come on. Can I green? I gotta green that, honestly. Another wide open look. Another white. I am smoky right now, but he knocks down the white. He's up to eight points already. What I like what I'm seeing so far. I got a green though. That's the only thing. Um, I don't he has the same book bases like Devin Booker, Donovan Mitchell. It's that base four, which they're good D, by the way. Good stuff. That's what I like out of that's what that's what I want to see is him getting active on the defensive end of the court. Just shot by Dikembe as well. Um He's got the same basis like Devin Booker and Donovan Mitchell. And that base, I feel like, is very dependent on the upper in terms of how easy it is to green. And I think this one is solidly easy to green. I think I'm just struggling with it right now, which uh, hopefully is something that I can um, fix quickly. But getting right back at it. 
Let's play, just play another defense possession. This guy just runs around. Okay, that's fine. You can run around with uh, John Wall. It's cool. Still up 11 to 4. Landry Fields has been involved in every single possession so far. Driving the rim. We're going to go up strong and we're going to get blocked. That's tough. It is totally fine, though. Chase down from John Wall. Totally cool. And again, I, I just want to apologize. I know my energy isn't super high in this video. It's very hard to have a lot of energy when COVID is when you have COVID. I'm just that's just the way it is. Good green though by Landry Fields. That's good stuff. Um, but dog, y'all have no COVID is such an odd experience. I'm just quick tangent. My dad has it as well, and he can't taste. And he said it's the most the weirdest experience basically that he's ever had. Um, he, he he can't smell a thing, which has to be just so odd. Luckily, I haven't lost my sense of taste, but definitely not the most fun having COVID. Uh, and I think y'all can hear my voice. I just, it's kind of strained. Don't have a lot of energy, kind of a sore throat and stuff. But we're still pushing through, getting that content. And this Landry Fields car is doing his thing. Uh, moving at a high level. Good steal. That's two. Yes, sir. Behind the back. I like the pro one behind the back. That's the same behind the back that, like Kobe it has. It's a good jumper for sure. Or it's a good behind the back for sure. Tried to force the midi there. Not honestly a very good shot. Dikembe gets the rebound and puts it back in, though. We're up 16 to 4. And what? Yeah, Landry has 11 and 1. That's pretty good. Good D. Yup, cut him off. He's just trying to run side to side, and it doesn't work. Beautiful. That's good defense. Get it to Landry. Stop on the break. I would have liked to shoot that, but he closed out with Del Curry. Draws a foul. It's fine. Um, we're going to get the ball right back to him, though. Honestly, I might try to go by him again to the rim, see if we can get a dunk. Uh, if he's not going to guard me, we'll just take the three. There's a green. Yes, sir. I'm telling you. His jumper is nice. I have, start, have started to figure out green to couple with him. He's got 14 points in this game. Definitely going to be a really, really nice catch and shoot shooter. Um, if you need a guy on your defense who can literally just catch the ball and shoot threes as well as play defense for a cheap price, this guy is going to be a great option for you. Um, similar to a guy like Gary Harris, I think he gives you a decent amount of value on both ends of the court in terms of his ability to catch the ball and shoot run in transition and dunk the ball and then play defense it's really really simple good three and d guy but you need guys like that on your team uh, especially if you're kind of a no money spent or a budget player and you don't have the mt to get the most expensive the top shooting guards in the game the guys like kobe bryant uh vince carter things like that uh, knocks down a the white there i think that was a full bar so that may have been another green but uh 22 to 4 wins 17 points one assist and two steals six of ten five of eight from the field really good performance by uh landry fields let's hop back into the main menu and review the card all right in conclusion landry field super solid card um definitely a great three and d option for his price which is probably gonna be less than five thousand mt he's just a phenomenal option at that shooting guard position or even a small forward position if you need somebody to play some defense catch and shoot from the corner and do his thing uh, also one thing i will mention just because i didn't look at the card the badges that can he that can be upgraded on him um, earlier it's a bunch of his silver badges as well as the ability to get badges like dimer uh quick chain intimidator uh quick first step um i mean he can get quick first step intimidator and dimer things like that like those three badges would be super nice definitely upgrade the card and then also if you add the couple of those uh silver badges to them as well you're looking at a card with what 20 something gold badges and looking like a super super solid option definitely a great card i think this landry fields is a phenomenal option for anybody looking for a shooting guard or small forward for cheap um definitely one of the better cards to drop in today's set as well if you did enjoy this video make sure you hit that like button leave a comment and subscribe and i'll be back with more 2k content very very soon i appreciate y'all peace